Hello everybody, this is Broderick Sodoff here, and this is how you pack a punch and get Juggernaug on Moon Area 51. It's uh, a decent strategy I've put together. I know you've seen other people do it, but it does take a few trial and errors. It's not the easiest thing to do on zombies. But what you do when you start out, you're gonna throw a grenade here to kill as many zombies as possible quickly. And if you go red, just keep on running like I just did. Alright, so you wanna throw the grenades in the earliest rounds. That's very important. And if you can, try and kill the dogs early as well. Because they pose a pretty big threat. And kill the crawlers as soon as possible. Now what you want to do is you want to buy a juggernaut. Hey baby. Jugs, good night. Uh, every beat that begins the zombies get harder. So now you want to spend all your ammo. I may have to fast forward some bits of this video for you guys as it may be boring. But yeah, you want to get them all in the group and try and kill them. And after that it's just sniping them. I also talk about what I think Black Ops who should do in the new DLCs that will come out soon. Alright, so for Black Ops 2, it's a bit disappointing to see the new fog in all the map. It's just not fun. Like, you want it to be like Skyrim, you can go wherever you want, but it's zombies. How could that be? It would be very good. I mean, like, Moon is a great map, I've got to tell you that. It was such a breakthrough, and they've just, like, gone back down to crappy now. It's not that bad, but you know what I mean. If you play a lot of zombies. Yeah, I got no rounds. I've only done this once before because it takes a while. But I thought I'd record it. I love this style of the 1911. It looks very nice. Alright, so I've gotten 30 kills. Not bad. It's better than what I was doing before. I only have like 20 kills by now. So what you've got to make sure is that you kill as many as you can in the early rounds. That's all that matters. After that, it's just stop the mic. Since you can take four hits, you can sort of knife till you take two hits. That sort of works to speed stuff up. You won't be killing any with knife. Hits too long. Eventually, you will. I've killed one since then. It's probably a crawler, but. And if you go red, I can't stress this anymore. You have to run as fast as you can like that. It's very important. I put this video in part. Part 2 will be coming now. Hello everybody, part 2 is here now. Alright, in this situation you have to run when you go red. And at the early rounds, try and kill as many dogs as possible as well. They're one hit kills for the first few beeps. This isn't a bad strategy, so just walk back with the knife. The only things that can get you is the dogs. 
you go up fairly quickly in points. Like in straight areas like this. But be aware that you can get double hit fairly easily. I love these characters, hate the new ones. They just suck. No offense to them. No hearts, buttercup. Alright, now that there's more dogs, it becomes a bit more difficult to do. Only like 200 yeah, more hits on the ground. So, this is the basic strategy. Stuff you up badly now. Going on a bit of nothing here. Yeah. I do my commentaries while I play, so at the moment I am actually playing. That's what I like to do makes it easy to set up the file and everything like I'm pretty hey, why are my guns it's so pretty hard? easy Hit. to do it like this because you don't have to worry about putting your audio on the video to the it's like doing a live stream but it's not like don't have enough subscribers to do a live stream which will get views I mean, buying this map, even if you don't have it at the moment of Black Ops 2, it's worth it. You get so much fun out of it. And the graphics are still great. Need the juice. I'd say they're pretty similar to Black Ops 2, even though the game's like two years older. So I'm playing it on gaming computer, and you don't really notice much of a difference. That's true. Anyway, I'll cut out this next bit of the video because it'll take too long. Well, everybody, uh, this is Gordrick Sodoff, and I've got my Mustang Sally now. There we go. I'm do the train around here. No arms, buttercup. And yeah, that's it. Just going on a train. It's pretty good having this thing, sorry. Just relax. It's not a bad strategy, this. Just training around the teleporter. Pretty classic zombie moment. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, comment, rate and subscribe.